feet. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking, or is it you? Johnny, you're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look... different. <laughs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm the third time around. Hey, Rogue. Ready? Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? He'll join us later. See you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This Johnny's Porsche? 
<laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. The one Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a Thought day. Thought so, too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there. A million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up our Osaka HQ. All right, V. Tell me what's going on. For real. Meaning? Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. All right. Johnny Silverhand. Apparently, you're a positive influence on him. I don't believe it. It really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right. Do your thing. I'll watch. Okay. Gotta be the past, this. Guess we really are going to the movies.
All right, well, let's go. Well done. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. It's your thing. Right, let's go check the projector. Entrance is over here. Okay, looks like I found the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and run. Hmm. Interesting. Bushido 10. Fade to black. Must be a classic by now. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. Have fun, you crazy kids. Grabbed us the best spots. Hop on up. How you imagine this evening going? Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. I like 2077, Rogue. A far inferior version. Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? I'd do everything in my power not to lose you. Johnny, I... Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing. It's just... I had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. Sure that's it? Nothing about Grayson or Smasher? What? What's Smasher got to do with anything? Getting the sense you still got a thorn in your side there. Cause I do. I'm irate, disappointed, but rather not think about it now. All that counts is I'm back. With you. Think that's way better than any what if. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here.
Johnny, I can't. It's not right. <sighs> mean and not fair to V? Not fair to you. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself for a little. <sighs> Get back on my own. Rogue. Fuck. Gone. Yep. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Got a mullet over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No, Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. Hey, look! Who would have thought? Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both.
one of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it. This ought to work. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carey got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where do you hear anything about Carey? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your big night out. So what? Wanna pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. So I gotta hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person. Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. Well? Okay, but I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V-Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay, just let me know when you want to take the wheel. Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive, at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Now, <laughs> fuck. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Doubt Carrie picked this. Always ate out. Always. Guess if I had a fave, 
it'd be that one. What's... Second conflict. Carried always goes straight for Kitch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. What's... Old single we put out. No idea why Carrie hoards shit like that. Okay. <laughs> Even I know that one. An oldie but a goodie. Played a few of these myself back in our samurai days. Acts like that run as many eddies? Forget it, we couldn't afford it. That's Carrie's fave. Butterfly Carey emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. Give him that one. actual necessity in this whole pad. He sits here and thinks, the fuck I need all this shit for?
shower. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. Ah, oh, feels so much better. Now let's see which are up for show and which are actually strummable. Keep playing. All right. Carrie? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. no That's some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? I told you to stop being a pussy. Did you? Huh? Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Okay. Weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh fucking contraire! Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Not looking all bad yourself, either. Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small time klepto punk from the afterlife? This is V. You like him. The fuck, Johnny? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Live here all by your lonesome? Nah, got my cook, Ariel, but he's off today. Miguel... What am I? Not your biz, Jum. Sit down. Start talking. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. Sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just Pop by to shit all over my life? Well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Oh, it is a heartbreaker. Oh, fuck. Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Who's that? Louise, the ex-wife. The what? Huh, <laughs> you're kidding. How long did it last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry, it worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo, cars, kids. Yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too then.
Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat-infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had an Ed to our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart in that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Stuff about you being depressed. It true. Nope. Promo strategy. Suicide attempts too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me, got no answer to that. Still in touch with the gang. Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Denny might still be in the biz. Actually had talent. In the spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just so, said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear it from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. Henry probably killed his own liver. Nah, I would've heard if he was gone. Got mutual friends. A few calls and I should be able to track him down. Best Isis, damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do... One gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened, all this. Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. We'll just say you're my new input. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Hmm. I'm not there. Figure it out with V. Sure. Uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. Johnny, you okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. The hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Gets sharper as the pills wear off. So? Wanna see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. Nah, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay, calling Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice.
Uh, Nancy? Uh, I mean, uh, Bess? Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News, how can I help? Want to talk to Bess? She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. Anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better head to the Totentons.